The tone of the match was set in the first minute when a Kumul's mistake led to a Julian O'Neill try. O'Neill comes and goes right through. Julian O'Neill! Oh, what a try! The great O'Neill! Scott Prince would bag a double while Chris Walker would also add another four-pointer. George Keller scored the only and controversial try for the Kumuls in the first half. It was, the, the, it was a very bad pass, but he was able to block that out of the years. A little play coming in from the Kumuls. After half time, PJ Marsh would add another four pointer, signaling what could be a walk in the park for the Broncos. And, stag, and this is Mento, and a very easy try in the end to that man. Scott Mento. However, the Kumuls hit back with three tries to Rodney Pora, Gimapau K. Melo and Robert Volu to reduce the score to 28 points to 22. The Broncos legends showed their class with tries to Terry Rida and Petro Sivanasiva to extend their lead 42 to 22. A Larsen Marabe try in the final minutes of the match concluded the scores at 42 points to 28. 1992. Yeah, 1992. Yeah, Terry, a try by Lassen Morape. I think the legends have scored. Uh, we missed that one. You had you back to it, but. And to end the match, the last play was given to this young kid who ran the length of the field to score the final unofficial try of the match.